Um, we just had an actually very fun run with uh, our buddy Action over in uh, Alex. I no no, it was Burden of the Sun, Savage. It was quite a burden. Well, we did not succeed. It was definitely fun, and I never got around to making our Heaven on High food last night, did I? I'm sorry. Break them. I am so sorry. It is my fault. Maybe. I know I should do better. Okay. Well. Oh yeah, I have inventory space again. Come on. Hello, Ripley. Welcome, welcome. Hey, hey. Ooh, yes, we have audience. Yeah, eventually. <laughs> Hello, Aki. It's great to see you guys this evening. Sorry we're getting a little bit of a late start, but uh, things happen. People died. Hello, Ace. We died. We died lots. And we're, yes. Hopefully Sadly, we will we not die not. tonight. Tonight we will good. make it to floor 81. That is our hope. That is our wish. That is our goal. You up for this? Who, me? Yeah, you. Oh, um, I'm gonna be that way about it. <laughs> the lady in red. I suppose. <laughs> <sighs> hey, this is a perfectly practical dress. You'll never tell that I'm bleeding. Okay, everything is in good shape. We'll see how many levels that lasts. There's a coffer. Intuition! Nada. And safety! Oh, I like safety. Okay, and I'll be right behind you. Uh, this is a dead room. Mm -hmm. Yes. Lots of on rows. We're gonna have to take one of them. Nine seconds on this, uh, debuff. Yeah. And since I'm only a medic instead of a doctor, I can't cure you of it. No. Um, yeah. He turned around and, and of course, we had a way. chest in the previous room. <laughs> yep, there it is. Five stack of poison. Five stack of poison. Ow. Intuition. Oh, good. We need a refresh. Stay still a moment. There, line of sight. Oh, thank you so much, Foxfire. That's awesome. He yes. resubbed on us. Yay. Yay. Thank you so much. It is so appreciated. I still need to get around to drawing out those. Uh... Yes. Those emotes. Give him good value for his money. Okay, watch me. 
I've still got five stack at 25 seconds. <laughs> right. Mimic. Of course it's a Pulling mimic. it back. Yeah, bring it back. No, no pox for you today! Get out the death trap! Feel the power of holy. Don't let me die! Try not to! Ooh, that was a really little close. Yes! Yes, I was! And of course, that's the exit room. Joyful! Well, it's clearer than it used to be. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying Foxfire. That actually makes yes. me really happy. Mm-hmm. Oh. Really? Yeah, really. Yeah, I can stop missing. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I'm not wearing my belt today. Why did he notice me? <laughs> Remember, there's no traps. There is a blue chest, however. And, there. and get we that still. Mimeso. Mimeso. But yeah, we still need to get the active. Uh, exit active. Which is why we're going to mud this, this guy in a dirt alley. Like that. There we go. And, and unfortunately, we're going to have to go through mobs to get to the exit. is the thing. I think oh. it's over. Yeah, I see it. Yeah. <sighs> Go get it. Okay, we could have done better, but we could have done a lot worse that floor either too. <laughs> yeah, it did not take horribly long and we lived. Living is good. I like living. Or to this floor. Blue Turn, chest. Turn, silver, I am full armor. Incoming. Thought I closed them on the way. One chest in here. Offer. Yep. <laughs> Intuition. We'll come back to that one, maybe. Yeah. Depending on convenience, really. Yeah. Incoming. Uh huh. Frankly, killing these guys beats killing a lot of other things on this level. Hello! Incoming. Well, at least they're nicely spaced so far. Yeah, but we do kind of need to get through this floor quick if we can. Okay, passage is active, so technically we don't need to kill anything else. You just need to find the exit and preferably hoard. Uh, this goes through... Meh. Meh. 
pick a direction. Oh man. Careful you don't get that car move behind you. I know. So far, he is not moving. We're gonna have to go through him. Damn. Yep. Hoping to avoid him if we could. I don't blame you. Thank you for the top one. Uh huh. Silver, no critters. Not at this level. No exit. These are cool. There's Jiboku going by. Bye bye, Jiboku. Yeah, you go that way and stay that way. He didn't even get off his, so. uh... No. He went down really fast. So, SS News for folks incoming. Um, they've dropped some There's the exit, and there's the horde next to it. Okay, um... Get the unreal? Yeah. Uh, there were a few interviews that were dropped this past week that have finally been translated. And so around. Uh, actually, go back for the... Or do you want me to go back for the um, other... Uh... Um, let's skip it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. There is a being shorter side of the map. So one of the things that's upcoming that they've pretty much been public non-spoilery knowledge is the Baja Rebellion Front, which is going to be our next section for the Relic Quest. Safety. Sure, we'll pop a safety. Uh, and, and we bail. Yeah, we bail. Um, the interesting thing is, one, it's going to be Eureka-like in the fact that it will be a, effectively an instanced area that up to 40 people can be in. However, uh, they are not going to tie it... Ooh, strength. Strength yourself. And we've got incoming mob. Uh, they're not going to tie it that you have to be within a party, i.e. it's not content you have, you can solo. Like, Eureka was kind of. People tried, but it was just murder to solo Eureka when it came out. Um, and it will have a series of fates. Think you can get that around the Unreal? Um, I'll see if I can. I'm being a little bit distracted. Yes, yes, you are. Patch contacted me. Oh, and of course, it's a stupid mimic. Trying to talk here, you stupid copper. No, no, no malice for you. Malice free zone. But they're doing effectively a series of battles. Fortune, I hear an incoming. Yes, same here. That are going to be fate derived. However, the the top 
player in the face, which will be somewhat ranked, will then be cordoned off to do a solo fight against the enemy commander, and we've got a four-corner room, oh bloody heck. <sighs> Wait, I just popped Fortune, right? Yes, Fortune is running. Uncle Craggy! Thank you, Uncle Craggy! And intuition. And we have hoard this floor. Um, sight? Sight! And the hoard is right here. And we have a copper. Dang it! The mimics are loving you this level. Hush you. But the solo instance for the commander was described as a single player ultimate. Strength. Strength yourself. I just did. Okay. We've got several strengths. Do you want to refresh? Right. Uh, done. Nothing in there. Oh, it's another intuition. Wait, it's another intuition. Yes. The time delay on... Messages. Messages is kind of annoying. <laughs> yeah. So I thought that was an interesting idea that the one person in a 40 man that does the best gets a shot at taking out the commander solo. Yeah. And they better know what they're doing. <laughs> Super potion. So we'll have to see how it works out. Um, on the Eureka front, they apparently have retooled it so that it's more soloable, so that it has a longer life to it, i.e. future-proof. And that's one of the reasons why we probably should go back and finish that chain. Um, we originally started the Eureka chain before Stormblood came out and could not finish it because the one area that we needed to ooh, light, uh, go through quest-wise, there was no one else there, and we just couldn't two, we could just barely two-man our way through it, but it was tooth and nail. Um, the other thing they stated is that you don't... Ooh, another intuition. More intuition. And we do have Horde this floor. Yes, yes we do. Not in this, this room. Yeah, let's skip it. Yeah. Um, or in place anyway. Is that another four corner room? Actually, it looks like a three corner room. Yeah, it doesn't look quite that bad. The so thing is, is I don't know if we can get them down in 10 seconds. No, it's a four corner. Uh, Just pick something. I was debating whether we want to take this as the fast route or slow route, and we've got incoming marble. Yeah. There's nothing heavenly about it, I'm sorry. And there's our next volunteer. He does not like pulling too well. well that's his problem. Hammer just got it. 
Jellyfish. Okay, I just picked him up. Yep. Yay! Get down. Oh, that's half the room. Mm-hmm. Frailty. Yeah, sure. That'll help. Inferno. Oh, another Inferno. To replace Uncle Craggy. Yes. Instead, we have Cousin If. And that dropped a test. Yay. Alteration. Let's Let's speak out this way. Or not. Uh, with him, you should be able to get to that other chest. It depends on if that uh, kid trap will let you. No, it won't. Serenity. Which doesn't matter. Yeah, that was kind of worthless. Man. Need to find Horde and Exit. One Not chest. here. Not worth it. Okay. Exit is active. Yep, yep. And there's the exit. Uh, the other thing there's that came Horde. out is that apparently there is enough story and dialogue recorded to make a two plus hour movie. Yeah. Ow! He nailed me good. Cover me. Okay. Four sixty-five, and we're twenty minutes in. Not great time, but not bad. So I'm, I am seriously thinking oh. we want to go ahead and stream on like a weeknight. Us going through the current content. Do you want me to speed run this? Mm. Actually, what does that chest say? Strength, but items are unavailable. Except for Serenity. Well, yeah. Okay, let's do this the hard way. Hug the wall. One exit. So, I am really kind of looking forward to the new story content update. Give me story! Give me story or give me death? Concealment. Concealment. Nah. Gonna have to start killing things. Uh, three exits at, at least. <laughs> yeah, at least. Start killing things. Four. Uh, oh god, this is gonna be painful. around the more wall. Yeah. There's the return and a silver. Get that Iwamushi. Armor. Super potion. Come on, give us a serenity. Alteration. Take out your frustrations on them. Coming 
Morble. Ow. Yeah, our okay. major concern about story is that we are jumping way ahead of things in a story that's pretty damn um complicated. Complicated, and you kind of need to know what's going Get before. Get that guy. I'm working on it. And the story for uh, Shadowbringers was pretty darn big. And important, and bring a Kleenex, you'll need it. For a person that, yeah. Starting off with the top uh, most northern oh, one. Oh, it's active. I hadn't realized it was active. Yeah. Stay back. Stay back. With our luck, it's probably alluring. 25% chance of being the real one. Go for it. <sighs> Enfeebling. Innervation. Okay, one third chance of the next one being real. Want me to go for it or wait the yep. 40 seconds? On um, innervation, I wouldn't worry. Get it. Luring. Yeah. switching targets. Yeah, I'm sorry, I didn't have... Uh, I'm sorry. Meow. Not your fault. Totoro comes out and shakes his tiny fist. Yoshi P! I should have just popped a Serenity and we should have just ate the uh, palms. Eh, well, maybe... It's just kind of hard to do that in the lower 60s, knowing what's coming. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I still have about three maps. Reset your progress. Just dead. Well, guys, do we want to uh, do maps, or do we want to start our climb again? Do, do, do. The, really, yeah, the really fast part of the climb. Trip, 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 trip. <laughs> we have an item good either way. Though it's early, we can probably get through a couple levels if we speed it. File. Oh, yeah. Why don't we go ahead and give it a shot? with a fixed party. Wow. Since we're not worried about scoreboard, we'll go ahead and start on 21. Zane uh, the other day doing his run 
exit purity. And he was doing a lot of, I'm just going to pull everything uh, and live. It doesn't work so well when we do that. But at the same time, he had an interesting thing that was like, oh, ooh, I hadn't thought about that one. Uh, he's mostly doing his Dark Knight, which is kind, kind of his favorite well, at the moment. Oh, I thought he was basically just trying to get through the various classes all the way to the top, and he just did that one, so he'll be doing something else now, maybe. Uh, no, he's now doing Palace of the Dead as Dark Knight. Ah, right. Yeah, there was Heaven on High. Okay. Um, but the thing he was doing is Dark Knight has an ability. It has kind of a long cooldown timer called, um, ah, I had it just a minute ago. But effectively what it is, is it's an AoE that damages enemies and for the amount of damage returns a percentage health back to... Oh, all that. Really, Adruva already here? Yes. One of like two on this level. And they're both in the same row. So what he was doing was he was grabbing like 20 people, getting nearly dead, then popping that and healing to full. That was ability. Wow. It was really <laughs> impressive. Okay, we're out of here. Really? Really? On 22? Really? Oh, we got one exit here. There's a lot of size suits. Watch out for the uh, control wheels. Hmm. Wheel of control, turn, turn, turn. Oh, and I'm blinded. Dang it. In fact, I'm just gonna go ahead and get Troll Wheel. Just being off board, something. Okay. You two are being off board. Someday. There it is. Really? Really? Three of them in a row? Really? Yeah, really. <laughs> ah, Daruvas. Sight. Strength. And it looks like only one exit. Fortune. Which is active. Yeah, the trapped exits are not as common at this level. They do happen, but... So we can bail. Working on it. Yeah, one of the things that the game's suffering from right now, which is of absolutely no fault of Square Edix, Yoshi P, or their crews, is the fact that, well, things kind of got bollocks because of the thing going on, which is still going on. Um, so the expansion that was supposed to happen back in, what, April? Is now effectively scheduled for August. Concealment. Oh, we got two wheels. Double auto time at the uh, at the casino. 
something like that. So we kind of hit gold saucer earlier already. Yeah, I know. Exit with the silver. Come on. But yeah, a, a lot of people are like, you can tell there's a lot of the player base kind of rolling around trying to figure out what to do to stay online while they wait for the uh, next uh, patch to in drop. <laughs> it's kind of funny, actually. There's actually whole videos of, um, do this while you're waiting around for the next patch to drop. <laughs> Uh, I think there was. We need like one. Not... Probably at this rate. Yep, there's a Druva. Eh, a Druva. We always like picking on Druvas because they just like picking on us. No. No? No? no. Yeah, one of the other problems that's having that's happening right now is actually dealing with housing. Uh, it was always bad to begin with uh, because in FF14 the housing is not instanced. You have these effectively districts where you can buy a house and you can actually walk around to other people's houses and see what's going on in them if they have them open. The problem with this is, is with um, COVID stuff going on, they've locked the housing timers. If you don't use your house, step through the front door of your house within a certain time period, it will get auto demolished and make way for someone else. The problem is, is there's literally not enough houses for the player base since Shadowbringers dropped. So you have people effectively in click wars trying to buy housing slots for 20, 30 hours. And it's causing real issues. By the way, there's no auto heal. Ooh. Feel better? Much. Thank you. Uh, just in the far corner. Yeah, of course there is. Um, and a lot of people, one of the reasons why they did the housing this way is they want people to effectively form neighborhoods and communities. But that isn't, at least from what I have seen, not really working out to their. And yeah, it doesn't really happen. It's just... It's creating a housing situation and... that is impossible that if you haven't been playing for several years to get a house, uh, people are actually doing really kind of mean and cruel troll maneuvers Yeah, to get what's available if anything's available. It's just ugly. They really should have just made it instant. Now, you can get an apartment. I think I'm bringing a samurai. Uh, but you can't You can do... always tell a samurai, but you can't tell them much. <laughs> Why do I do this with you again? Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> but with the apartments, you can't use any of the outdoor furniture. 
and you can't really garden and crossbreed, which is its own little sub-game, which is kind of important if you're a crafter. Exit here with like two chests. Now, from all reports, there's going to be a new housing zone opening up once we get the Ishgar restoration done. But my, uh, with the way it's going, I honestly don't think we'll see the. The new development pop in until the next expansion or right before. Yeah. Switching. Strength. So we will wait and see. But housing is actually one of the weaker things in the game yeah. for getting housing. Once you have housing, you can actually do a lot and it can be pretty fun. Well, it's another one of those places where, you know, they're like second best. They don't have the best version of it, but they have a fairly solid version of it. Especially compared to the number of MMOs that just didn't really have it. But I also look at the current, um housing situation. Okay, Drew, that's enough out of you. And go, well, this is a great way to keep people in-game. It's also okay. a great w a way of keeping people from returning to the game. If they, if you log for a amount of time because of other things, you know when you come back, your house is gone. And that's actually a barrier from coming back. Sight! Wheel! Exit down here. Bunch of three rooms. Q Kigan, Q Kigan. Wow, that's a lot of Q Kigan. I can try rounding them up. I think we can take all three. Probably at this level, yeah. Especially since I can see the trap. Yes, that helps a lot. Okay. Yeah, that that was pretty nice. Fortune. Fortunate. Petrification. Strength. And more fortune, maybe? Well, that was the one that I had you do it for. If we're careful, we can go right now. We'll miss a chest, but oh well. No! No, Theron is not the fortunate son! <laughs> no! <sighs> he knows RN Jesus hates his dad. Here. 
he will never go anywhere again. So we do kind of have kind of a room here. Do you want me to try and round it? Maybe part of it. Not necessarily everything. No. Two thirds of it. Three or four guys. No! Him! out a chunk fast. Yes. Of course, he clears out a chunk of me fast. Purity. Do you feel any pure? Frailty. Ow! Ow! Super Bowl! Good. Sorry about yeah. that. The good news is you were tanking, so no nobody hit me during that. Aga Silver Access Passage. Yeah, the wheelie dudes are actually pretty easy to deal with. They're... So they really do hit hard if they hit. Yeah. Not that bad. Do you want to try and go for that gold? Uh, maybe. There it is. Ah. Flight. Okay, let's see if we let's can fly out of here. Sneak out of here. There is a chest just behind the um teleporter. Yeah. It's oh, a bronze. It's a bronze. We could probably use shards. Oh, freaking! Or we could use a mimic. But we'd use it for. I'm not sure. Incoming wheel. Get in. The, get in here. Hello, Mr. Wheel. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, I need to feel something with my mic here. Silver. Let's take that down a little bit so I'm not clipping. That should be a little better. Incoming wheel. Wheel of fish? That wheel of fish? No. Trust me, you'll know if there's ever a wheel of fish in here. You'll be all over it. Yeah, there is no uh, there is no buffet in this dungeon. I'm sorry. Inferno. Yes. Hello, cousin If. I think I just heard. Yep, a new serenity. Oh, yeah. No. It's a Petrification. I'm about to draw that too, I think. Yep. Oh, good grief. Yeah, you said, uh, I'm about to draw the Tingu when I, like, pulled two mobs on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, your timing is horrible! Thank you! <laughs> it's part of being a great bard. You're not playing a bard. I mean as bard. 
At least I used to. I'm kind of maiming it as red mage these days. <laughs> <laughs> that is always hilarious. That that happened to me like last week. Oh, let's blow this Potato stand. Yes. Let's not stay here. It is a silly place. Yeah, they have that particularly large lankiness to them. I can totally see you making the connection between them and yeah. the uh, main force spirit from Mononoke. Petrification. You ready? Number four. Popping. Luring trap. Still alive. Thank you. You ruined my beautiful no. petrification. Yeah, well, sorry. I know there should have been an earth earth shattering kaboom. I've got three at once. By the way, we have one more floor to boss. Mm. It is getting to be that time, isn't it? Yeah, let's go ahead and bail. Yeah. See if we can get another set of floors in before we call it an evening. yourself. Done. That'll make the boss go even faster. Mm-hmm. If people don't remember, he is actually a unique model and boss to the game. All the other bosses tend to be recolors and retools of other bosses found elsewhere. Haruko is not. Yeah. He's his own person. Ready? Oh yeah. Hey Haruko, how's the wife and kids?
Verhoy. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, I look good in that dress. <laughs> yes, yes, you do. I need to get back on that. You've got a lot of other things to do. I still need to get back on it. Sniff. And of course it dumps us right out. We have to go right back in. Yep. Because of course that's the plot break. Yeah, uh, turns out apparently uh, Patch did some uh, DMing. Oh! And he did a session report uh, and posted it to uh, RPGG mm -hmm. and he was confused because he couldn't find it. It's in Geek Mod. Which is why he couldn't find it. Geek Mod? Geek Mod. Oh, right. He's waiting for moderation. Yeah. That's the internal user moderation. So, A, make sure that uh, this really is a session report, right? And, of course, they decide how much they like it and give them a deep full, full reward. Uh, fortune, make us fortunate. In a second, unless you want to do it. No, I want to heal. I like you, this healing thing. It's all the verage. Ha 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 ha. Let's see if we can get there. For what? <laughs> oh, right. Um, fortune! Ver fortune. Big long um, line AOE. Right. That's what hit me. I thought I got out of that. Frailty? Sure. Especially since I'm taking quite a mess. Oh dear. Yeah, that's three different concussions there. Um, I some help. One guy down. Two concussions down. There goes the third. Live! Live! <laughs> Did I go the wrong direction? Yeah, I went completely the wrong direction. <laughs> no, You're I've got this. Run. I, I, I actually have this. <laughs> that was um quite a fight. It looked it. Oh, look, another frailty. And just remember, it's them who should be frail, not you. <laughs> well, part of it is I want to see where we kind of need to... Oh, and here's the exit. I need to get a little more gutsy in our play. Their guts, not yours. Raise hand, good. Oh. I like 
freezing. Oh, that was worth being the extra trip. Ow! Yeah! Hit a landmine in the middle of a fall. And I I'm think I've got this. Good, because I can't help you. I have high impedance. Nice! For people. Affluent. No, there's nothing for about it. Shoot, I shouldn't have used that. Oh well, it's just affluence. It's not that big of a win. No. Might actually help us in the long run. Dirty. Yeah. Sears of the Ground City. My first time as a D as a DM. Should have picked something simpler. Just so you know, there is an outbound controller out there. Okay, give me a second. I need to answer a question. You do all that. I, I'm, I'm figuring I'm kind of on my own because I saw the question. Right. Remember about the gutsier bit. I could use some help. Thank you. Okay, back to typing for you. Okay, back to typing for me. <laughs> someone in, uh, just for reference, uh, someone in guild asked Security. where they can purchase something that's kind of hidden. Yeah, they make that part way too complicated. Especially since they don't simplify it down when it's no longer in the current stuff. Come join me at the exit.
you can stand still with this music going, I don't know. Okay, I think I've answered the question. Uh, part of <laughs> what the uh, guildy was asking was where to buy a certain something, which in this case was his the top end main weapon. Ooh, petrification. Ooh. Set yourself up. I am set up. I am using it now. Um. Basically, his main weapon he needs for the level range he's working at is he just hit in game of the like previous two expansions. The know? first expansion, basically, yeah, he's at sixty. Okay, the dungeon should be clear. I should hope so. Ooh, I finally got another Phoenix down. Yay! I thought you had one. I used it last run, or the week previous, oh. and then never replaced it. Huh. But it's apparently one of the things they're going to be looking at simplifying for the weapons. Oh, good. You have to go in and you have to, instead of just buying the weapon directly, you have to buy like two intermediary steps and then once you have the weapon, a third step to augment it to get to the final yeah. value you need it at. And it's like, and it's from like four different vendors to get the stuff. <laughs> it is so unclear. Estuva, we're being very serious. <laughs> Hello, Duva! Action keeps looking for you in game. <laughs> Better Duva than Druva. <laughs> Ow! I'll get you. Just survive for a few seconds. There you go. So, are you gonna do that again? The answer would be yes. If they just want to stand there while I'm fighting totally next to them, that's their problem. No, no, I'm talking about the uh, go flying over the explosive trap. Oh, God. Uh, oh. <laughs> the fact that you don't touch ground and it still goes off. That just strikes me as unfair. Yes, it is unfair. It's completely unfair. Did I see an inclusion? Yes. Probably like number three, I'm not sure. Of course, we have no items at the moment. Uh, of course we do. I'm dealing with a couple of mobs here. It's going to take me just a moment. You're dealing with them? Is it the big fucking deal? <laughs> Watch it, we might get demonetized for that one. <laughs> That's your one the entire run. Be a good kitty. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'd love to hear the original that's from, though. Oh god, it was hilarious. Because <laughs> apparently there's like, what, a, uh, about a half hour of what was effectively radio show just to get to that line. Yeah, yeah, it was like a half hour radio show just to get to that line.
Okay. Four down, five to go, plus boss. Uh, so you know, Duva, uh, we're... The current plan is tomorrow. Hopefully I can get online early enough that we can actually <laughs> try and take a stab at... Um, misery? Misery memory, uh, yeah. Let's just call it misery and be done with it. <laughs> Fortune! And the more guildies that can come along, the there it is. better. Charity, not needed. You haven't unlocked! You have not done Ruby Weapon? How dare you! Go do Ruby Weapon! <laughs> Actually, no, it's not Ruby Weapon, it's the, um... No, it's Ruby. No, no, uh, for Memoria, that's the, uh, Relic well, Chain. yeah. That's Inception. Yes. And the main version of that is pretty nasty all on its own. Okay, something was wrong there. You're the tank and he was the tiger. <laughs> I see what you did there. Yeah, that's what how many other people do. Hi, Duva. Okay, we can actually bail if we want to. In fact, we might want to. Yeah. My bad. Stop that. I know, I know. It's not like you know where we're going. <laughs> I was following you! You looked like you know where you were going. I kind of thought I did. Does it trap you down and break your legs? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. Misery? Uh, yeah. Yeah. It straps you down, it breaks one leg, then the other, then your arms. And then it tells you ew, that you're a failure to your entire family to your face. Yes. Yes, it does. Oh my god. You ready for a frailty? Oh, uh, yeah. Frailty! I'll go ahead and clear the exit room. Because it's, good. we have to go through it anyway. Yep. Ah, crap. I thought I was out of You're okay. He's alright. Oh! Oh ho! Oh, did we get. We got Grandpa yes. Odin! Now, if we can just survive long enough to use, use it for once. <laughs> but that's the first time we've seen Odin in quite a while. Yeah. We've missed you, Grandpa Odin! Oh, hello! <laughs> Nicely done. Oh, he got that turned off anyway. 
casse un stick pour tout de suite. are saying that, yeah, this is an easy one! Really? And I'm like, Twitch. I've been in there. Twitch, really? Twitch. Twitch. This is my eye. See a Twitch? <laughs> what in that possibly constitutes easy? And I'm like, if this is easy, Heavey scares the crap out of me. <laughs> And I, I know watching action in Sky trying to do Hades, and they're just coming back in tears. Oh, yeah. That was fairly miserable from the sounds of it, too. Incoming Dugu. Uh, sight. No dude going around it? No. I'm skipping that chest for the moment. Wow. There's a Dooku factory around here somewhere. Okay, head for the exit. Uh, and the two silvers. After this Dogu. I'll get the Dogu and get this back. There we go, passage active. Steal! Stealing myself! Time this run! Mm hmm. Line the side up. There you go. Yep. Sir, you do not get a second chance at this. Oh, uh, not much. I mean, there. As far as I know, there. Since uh, you get sucked into the mobile space. Uh, mm -hmm. There hasn't been really any expansion stuff because, of course, everything got locked down because of COVID. Um, there is supposed to be a live letter next week. Uh, the next. Um, oh wow, two silvers. Yeah. Or not. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> um, Disappointed kitty. The next. Is supposed to drop August 11th. They have officially announced that the next actual expansion is going to be delayed by about six months in the cycle. Mm. Which is sad, but at the same time, er with everything that's happening in the world, I don't blame them. I would rather yeah. their staff be safe. After all, this is a game. It's not like um, other thing, something else like fire or other actual services that are life dependent. Look away! Or not. Right now, uh, they are repeating the um, break, breaking bricks. Um, the FF11 crossover. Yeah, event. thank you. Actually, no, it's uh, Dragon Quest X. 
True, true. Eleven was the uh, previous one they repeated. Yeah. Strength. Nope, no strength yeah, I for can't you. Do anything about it. Sniff. Oh, Sniff you are kitty. not going to like the next room. That's a given. You are totally not going to like the next room. It's a four-corner four room. Still seen worse. Wow, look at them all gathered around the uh, water cooler. Yes, yes, I know. It's like a uh, Damn, guys. full metal alchemist convention. <laughs> yes, yes. And it's the cosplay meetup. Yes, it is. <laughs> Oh, he got that off. Didn't do him much good. No, no it didn't. Uh, otherwise, I can't think of much. Uh, housing demo timer has been paused. Excuse me, Alphonse. Hmm. Right. Love that. I like the Joe just sitting there. Yeah! Shall we? Oh, silver. He is no longer just sitting there. Oh, bugger. Okay, we're out of here. I was sitting here in the exit, peacefully minding my own business. Has Adam Savage done one for uh, Full Metal Alchemist? I know he's done like Totoro and. Um, oh dear. I forget some of the others. He did actually a kind of nice medieval, proper medieval suit recently. Strengthening myself now that I can. Wow. <laughs> wow. Steal yourself. Steal yourself. Okay. Oh, Vortex! Nice. There. Clear all the way down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Keyword, yes. That is so true. Um, mm -hmm. He actually had a really nice memorial for Grant Imahara on uh, testing. Oh, good. Purity. Purity. I mean, that, that was a shock. Uh, Grant. Yeah. <laughs> Passing away when you Okay, did. boss time. Uh, he was what? 40 and. Around that. Uh, mercy be game. mercy, it was quick. Yeah. Yeah, 
I've been meaning to post it to the uh, Etsy Discord, but uh, one of my favorite artists actually did a really nice uh, memorial tribute piece for him. Let's try that again. I plugged that one. Oh, speaking of Bill Sykowitz, uh, you know about oh, the Bill Sykowitz butt challenge, right? There's a minute warning. Yeah, we're not. We missed our 30 minute mark by like 10 seconds. <laughs> yeah. But Linda Medley did a piece for the Bill Sykowitz butt challenge of Ooh, classic Japanese fart battles. It was awesome. She would. Oh, she, it was like so Linda Medley. It was a maze. <laughs> I keep thinking I should okay. submit something, but I have no idea what I would do. <laughs> I'm sure Philoidy could come up with something for you. <laughs> okay. Uh, it is 11 o'clock. Let's see what we get for complimentary mm -hmm. sparklers this week. <laughs> One gold halo sack, and that's only because I found it by accident. Yeah! We're on a roll this week. <laughs> Battle Dance 5. Peach confetti. Ooh! Fancy! <laughs> Here. I'll trade you some peach for my cherry. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, I bet. Oh. My dad is... Mm -hmm. He's in a slightly better place than he was before, but he ended up having a stroke. Which isn't quite the yeah. same thing as an aneurysm. Uh, one is lack of oxygen to the brain. The other is actually bleeding into the brain. But they can have very similar results. And let's just say it's kind of put the family in this weird mode of we do what we can, but there's only so much we can do and we're kind of miserable because we can't help financially the way we'd like to because mom actually has to ha hire a, a caregiver to come in like three times a week to help yeah and of course me and my sister we live really far away we can't just drop by and especially now with the, the lockdown thing uh, it's not as bad as it used to be, but it's not something we can just take up and drive three hours to see my dad for. My mom is no spring chicken by any stretch of the imagination. And my brother is just, he's doing the best he can, but he has to juggle my dad and my niece at the same time and my niece's special needs. So, it's, trust me, <laughs> you're not alone. I know there's a lot of other people out there in very similar positions to who we are. We just kind of muddle through as best we can and pray for our loved ones. Sometimes that's yeah. all we can do. Meanwhile, you're getting a big thank you from Ficking, speaking of special <laughs> needs. Not that he's special needs, it's just what he wanted. That entire setup is special needs. Yeah, <laughs> the entire purchase chain is special needs. And how long did it take us to figure us out? We were like well into Stormblood by the first. Like, wait, we could have upgraded our Shire gear? <laughs> wait, no, there were Shire weapons out, we I could sure purchase? <laughs> <laughs> we totally didn't know about the Shire weapons at all because they were like three menus on a completely different person that you have to go in and buy these two other items for a third person. <laughs> But thank you all for coming. <laughs> Sparkles, 
sorry we ended up kind of blowing it just trying to get to where we were last time, but uh, nah. we've at least gotten 20 more levels in for next time. Yep, yep, yep. Now, uh, as far as I understand, they are supposed to look at trying to trim that down. Thank goodness. Oh, uh, but they haven't announced when or where, so uh, I really hope they do because it took us a long time to figure out. Long past what when we really stop? needed that it. That was all you. <laughs> yeah, I I figured it out because I started lo really looking at the uh, vendors closely. It's like oh, my head hurts. <laughs> Well, thank you all. Um, as a reminder, tomorrow night we will be back on the Bun Buns doing Bun Bun things for our story hour. Um, as the usual bun time and the usual bun channel doing the usual bun story. Yes. And we are currently in the middle of investigating a murder mystery in North Shroud. So come uh, on yes. and see what's happening there. Anyway, you guys have a great night. Thank you for joining us in our random chatter and mm -hmm. our random deaths that were very random. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> a little too much on the death. One too many rounds with the snake. It's deep dungeon. These happen. You can yes. you can clear the entire floors all the way to a hundred. Come back in and die on floor one. Remember the night where we had problems getting off of about floor two? Yes, exactly. And it's Thankfully, we have not us. had that in quite a while. <laughs> you guys have a great evening. Hope to see you tomorrow night. You, be, mm -hmm. all, be safe. Sleep well. Stay well. Everyone have a great night. <laughs> Goodbye.